Well, it's arguably becoming more of a rivalry than Mizzou and Arkansas. Really, the game that ends up defining the season is this weekend. Mizzou will make the trip to Kentucky. The Tigers and the Wildcats have an interesting history. In his first season with Mizzou, Eli Drinkwood snapped the losing streak to Kentucky, beating the Cats for the first time since 2014. But UK still leads the series all-time 7-5. to five. This game always seems to be a pace setter for both teams. Win it, things start to look up, but lose it, they always seem to take a little dip. The mindset is it's a big game because it's the next game. I mean, we try not to put too much weight on any other situation. I mean, our job is to go out there and execute. I mean, it's the, we want to set the tone. We want to start uh, SEC off right, SEC, off, SEC play off right. Um, this is a, a big test, big challenge on the road. Like the atmosphere is going to be big, it's going to be crazy, but like what I said earlier, just focusing on where we are and what we got to do. So they really just been telling me, make sure I'm knowing all my details of my plays, making sure I'm knowing where I'm at. Well, it will be that guy's first time at Kroger Field this weekend. Wide receiver Mookie Cooper really turned a lot of heads in the offseason, but, but this past Saturday was the first time the redshirt freshman had played live action football since the 2018 state title game when his alma mater, Trinity, beat out Cardinal Ritter at Faroe Field. In that game against Central Michigan, though, Cooper was coming off of a lower leg injury. He finished the outing with four receptions for 12 yards. Overall, though, it sounds like the Ohio State transfer is just happy to be a Tiger. I just knew first off that I wanted to play in the SEC once I left Ohio State. So uh, it really came down to family is really a big thing to me. So this is home. And I know now, like, like in the last game, I had like 20 family members come to the game. So, I mean, it came down to trusting Coach Drink and the offense that they got and then where my family can come and be a big support. On my expectations, I didn't really have too many big ones. I just, like I said, I just wanted to go out there and just run and play and see, see what my foot felt like in live action.